Marissa from MyLifeSmovie.com and today I'm going to show you a question that lots of you have asked me which is how in the heck I pack my one carry-on suitcase to travel to multiple countries. So today I'm going to show you how I pack this Gabbiano carry-on approved size roller for three countries that I'm going to including two that are very hot weather destinations but require you to cover up because of the culture and we're going to squeeze in one more St. Thomas and see how I can get my tropical clothing in with my covered up clothing as I like to call it. So first things first, it depends a lot on your bag. You need to have the approved dimensions and I also really like the hard shell because in the long run it really helps with squeezing everything in there. So this is my Gabbiano. They have lots of different designs you can see on my blog following this post. Um, so yeah, that's where you need to start, and now let's get to the basics that you need to pack. So, starting with clothing. One thing that everyone makes a big mistake about doing is overpacking. You don't need everything. What I recommend, and this is again for three countries, is to pack only three tank tops of different colors, and I'm wearing one, so that counts, three sleeve shirts, and three long sleeve shirts. So that takes care of all of my basics for my tops. Keep in mind, if you look on my Instagram, it looks like I'm always wearing a different outfit, but it's not. I'm just wearing a basic with an accessory over it. So for pants, again, I'm going to uh, Egypt and Jordan. So those are definitely uh, places where you're gonna need to cover up sometimes because of the culture. Um, so I have two loose fitting pants, one pair of jeans to pack, and one pair of jeans that I'm wearing. And then, guys, sorry, I know you probably don't wear jumpers, but for the girls, I always recommend trying to get long sleeve jumpers because they can be very versatile. You can put a shirt over it and it'll look like you have pants, or you can just put a scarf on and it looks like you have a nice outfit. So these are my basics. That's all that I usually bring. And then I get to the fun part, which is the accessories. So, as you may or may not notice, in most of my pictures, I'm usually wearing a scarf and some sort of hat. These are genius and will save your life. Maybe not your life, but your suitcase. Anyway, you can get them at pretty much any like container store on Amazon. I have them on my blog. Um, basically what they do is instead of using a vacuum, you put your clothes in and you just squeeze the air out. So that's how I came up with this method of folding. I call it non-folding. To non-fold, you do as the name implies. You bake everything super flat, like so. And you fold in, trying as hard as you can not to overlap anything. Push them all in here. Flatten them out. Then to seal it, you just go like this. Now I like to use the compartments that come with my bag. So I simply plop it on in here, squeeze out the remaining air. And it fits. So a couple of other tips that I have are to obviously wear your bulkiest clothes on the plane so it doesn't take up space in the suitcase. Also, leave space for stuff you want to buy as you go. I honestly wear more clothes that I bought abroad than I ever have at home in the US. So leave space. Um, another little tip is that if you're going places that have a big extreme difference in clothing, for instance, 
I'm not gonna wear the same thing I wore in Egypt to St. Thomas. It's hot there and I can wear a bikini. So I put those clothes in a separate bag so that I don't mix them up and I don't have any problem organizing when I get to my first destination. So those are my little tips. Keep it basic and keep it accessorized. For guys, probably a little easier because you probably also don't care as much about wearing the same thing twice. Um, but hats work wonders for you too. Anyway, um, I wish you happy packing. Don't forget that this is gonna save you a lot of time and a lot of money in the long run, which is why I always recommend carrying one carry-on when you travel, especially to multiple destinations.